welcome back. So we left off our last video where I was showing you this awesome thrift haul. And I said I was going to decorate my back porch with all of my thrifted goodies that I found today. So I started with, whoa girl, slow down. I know you're excited, but stuff has to happen first. So I wanted to decorate my porch and I was so gung-ho and took everything out there and went to hang the little piece on the door and realized, no, this is not going to work. So I reeled myself in, got myself under control and woke up this morning and decided we're gonna paint the back door, get that done. <laughs> when James gets home. I also then realized I had no fall florals for the back porch. Oh, gotta have some mums if it's just one, you know? So, got the door painted, got all that done, got myself dressed, cleaned up. And from Lowe's and I bought a beautiful mum to coordinate with the pieces I have for the back porch and another plant that was on the clearance section. It's more of a summer plant, but it has fall colors. It's really beautiful. So we're going to be using that and I'm excited to see how it all comes together. Um, we spend a lot of time out there on the back porch when the weather, per, you know, is nice and allows us to. And this year we will have our New Zealand fan out there. So I'm really excited to pull all this together. So I'm going to go ahead and add my pillows, my florals that I have. I'm gonna go ahead and hang the piece on the door, but disclaimer, at the end of this video, I will show you what everything looks like at night with the new hardware. Right now the hardware is not on the door because James is not home yet and I will have some cleanup to do on the glass around the door. I tried to cut it in as best I could, but there's still going to be a little, there's going to be a few places to clean up, but I'm not doing that until next week. I'm going to give this paint time to cure. I don't want to disturb it. <laughs> I do not want another episode like happened when I tried to paint it in the summer. So y'all just going to have to just pretend it's not there and let's just see how all this looks when we pull it all together. I'm so excited, so let's get started. Okay, so far, this is what I've done. I've put one of the pillows on this chair, got my old toolbox, put my mom's, and this other plant, this, I don't know the technical name of them, but we always called them painted daisies. And then my daylily there. Um, I've already put this on here in my flower pot. <laughs> this is those thrifted goodies and we're gonna ignore the dead fern behind the bench. But this is one of those old boxes I got free. And this is my little stool that I went ahead and painted roughly. And we're gonna be using that. So this is the door painted with the fall piece on it. I think it looks so good. So now we're gonna decorate this area with our other thrifted goodies. This is what it's looking like. I love it. I love it so much. Can't wait to get the hardware on the door. Now, I got a comment about they don't understand why I use tablecloths or shower curtains as throws. Well, for one thing, I couldn't find a throw at my thrift store the color that I needed. And I don't know about you, but I'm not going to spend a fortune on a throw 
for it to be outside to possibly get ruined. So, I spotted the shower curtain, which is designed to get wet. So, I thought, nobody's gonna know. It's not like we really need it to cover up with. So, I just got it, threw it across there. And honestly, if I didn't tell you that was a shower curtain, you wouldn't know it was a shower curtain. But because I kind of share these th things that I do and why I do it, that's why. And I have found that you can just get the tablecloths or shower curtain so much cheaper in your thrift stores. And if they get ruined, you're only out a few dollars versus, you know, 12, 15 and on up for throws. So that is why I use that. Did this not work out perfectly? This houses our extension cord that I use when I'm using my uh, cooker out here. This is why I left this out here because when I bring my electric skillet out, I set it on that. And so I leave that there. But this is what the little back porch is looking like. And I love it. And if you didn't wanna, if I could find another pillow for this, then this is what it would look like with both pillows on it, which I kind of like that. So we may just leave it like that, <laughs> you know, but we have options, right? not feel like fall out here <laughs> but that's okay um i may i'm probably going to end up getting more mums for out here um and getting some for the front porch of course when i go to do it but this is a good start kind of lets me know what i need and uh i'm happy with it i mean it's all thrifted it'll be bad thrifted or free <laughs> so um i will show y'all what it looks like at night and after we get the new hardware put on the door. That's been needing to happen. Our other hardware was just rusted. It was just tacky and terrible, but I love the door black. I think it adds such depth and just makes it pop. Um, the one thing I'm kinda on the fence about is, do I need to add a bow to the top of this? Right here. I'm kinda on the fence about that. So, y'all have to let me know what you think. Should should I put a bow on there or just leave it as is? Um, yeah, you just have to let me know. What? Oh. What? Ah. How you feeling? Ah. You feeling pretty good today? Ah. Is daddy doing it right? Is he doing it right? You're, you're so handsome. Everybody's been worried about you and praying for you. You gonna tell him thank you? <laughs> tell him thank you. Tell him you love him, say I love you. Good. Good boy. You are a good boy. Pardon the outdoor noises, but new hardware is on. As you can tell, I added some flameless flickering candles. I put two there and I put one up here because I just didn't have anything to fill that little basket. And it's gonna be so cozy at night. And then I did put my old ladle in the toolbox and I really like it. <laughs>
my back porch decorated for fall. It feels so good out here. The ceiling fan going, candles, and I just love sitting out here enjoying our back porch. So thank y'all so much for hanging out with me. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye y'all. Thank you.